If you took out loans from the government to pay for a college that lied to you, you are entitled to relief. This consumer education video will provide you with information about the type of relief available and also walk you through the process of applying. This video is brought to you by Public Counsel, a nonprofit law firm that helps Corinthian students in their fight for financial justice. When Corinthian colleges declared bankruptcy in 2015, thousands of students were stuck with their federal loans. Many of these schools lied to their students about job placement rates and graduate salaries so that more people would enroll. This is considered fraud by the federal government. How do you know if you were the victim of fraud? If your school gave you false information about the numbers of students who got jobs in their fields after they graduated, or there were any other instances where you felt misled, there's good news. You can get the help you deserve through safe and legal means with no cost to you. The U.S. Department of Education is offering federal student loan relief for students of Corinthian colleges. This means that if approved, you will not have to pay back the federal loans you took out to pay for your education. Already, the Department of Ed has forgiven $247.4 million in debt owed by former Corinthian students. It is unclear how long this program will continue, so it is critical that you take immediate action. Here's how to get started. If you were a victim of fraud at a Corinthian school, you can apply to get your federal loans forgiven through the Borrower Defense to Repayment Program, or DTR for short. There are two tracks for applying for debt relief. Normal track, submitting documents through a standard defense to repayment process, which will apply for most students. Expedited track, filling out an attestation form as part of your defense to repayment process, which only applies for students who enrolled in certain programs during certain periods of time. To see the full list of programs and dates that are eligible for the expedited track, visit these links. If you did not attend these programs during these times, you can still apply for normal debt relief through the Defense to Repayment Program. To get debt relief through the Defense to Repayment Program, you can either submit an application online or download a copy to submit through the mail. By filling out this document, you are telling the government that you enrolled in a school based on fraudulent information that they provided you. To access the online application, visit this link. To download a copy of the form, visit this link. There are many ways that the school could have defrauded you. You only need to provide information for the sections that apply to you, but you must complete at least one section. Your loans will only get discharged if you went to the school based on fraudulent information. So be sure to check yes if applicable next to this question. Then, if you'd like to put your federal loans in forbearance while your application is being processed, Check the yes box where it asks, are you requesting forbearance stopped collections? Interest will continue to accrue while your loans are in forbearance. Submit copies of any documentation you have that shows you were enrolled in a particular program at a Corinthian school and documents that show they misled you. Some examples are transcripts, enrollment agreements, registration documents, promotional materials from the school, emails with school officials, your school's manual or course catalog, if you don't have any documents, you can still apply for defense to repayment relief by just submitting your application. The important thing is to apply with whatever you have. If you are submitting the application online, you will need to upload an electronic version of your signature. Just take a photo of your signature on a digital camera or smartphone and upload it to the application. If you're including additional documentation, make sure to scan these documents prior to starting the online process. If you downloaded your application, submit a copy of your application and documents to this email. Or send your application and all the copies of your documents via certified mail to this address. Right now, there's a backlog of applications and many students who have applied have not heard back yet, so be patient. Your loan servicer will contact you once the review of your claim is complete. Students who attended specific programs during certain enrollment dates have an expedited application process for getting their loans forgiven. These students only need to fill out the attestation document. There are two different attestation documents, one for students who were enrolled in WyoTech and Everest schools, and one for students who enrolled in Heald schools. To properly fill out the document, make sure you check one or both of the boxes in question one, as applicable. When you are finished filling out the form, submit copies of any documentation that proves you were enrolled during the dates you said. 
check the box at the end of the document if you'd like to put your federal loans in forbearance. Interest will continue to accrue. Once you complete the attestation form and attach copies of relevant documentation, you can send your materials online or through certified mail. Email them to this email or mail them to this address. Congrats! You are on your way to getting your federal loans discharged. Check out the links at the end of this video to learn more about federal debt relief.